Step back in time with us to the 1970s, a decade that fundamentally reshaped New York City. This era, marked by its distinct rhythm and vibrancy, was also a time of great socio-economic and cultural upheaval. New York, the city that never sleeps, was on the brink of bankruptcy. The fiscal crisis of 1975 was a turning point, leading to drastic changes in the city's infrastructure and society. The city's gleaming skyscrapers and bustling streets hit a more complex reality. The crisis served as a catalyst, pushing New York to reinvent itself in the face of adversity. In the midst of the city's struggle, a new form of expression was born, hip-hop. From the heart of South Bronx in the 1970s, this revolutionary music genre emerged, giving voice to marginalized communities. It was more than just rhythm and rhymes. It was a resonating protest against social injustices, a raw reflection of life on the streets. Hip-hop was not just music, it was a movement, a culture. In the face of adversity, New Yorkers found a way to voice their struggles and inspire a global movement. Underground, another form of expression was taking root, the subway graffiti. During the 1970s, as the city grappled with economic downturn and social unrest, New York's subway system became a sprawling canvas for the city's youth. This was not just rebellion against the system, it was a cry for recognition and assertion of existence. These vibrant, often complex works were more than just random scribbles on a train car. They were a visual language, telling tales of struggle, hope and survival. Each stroke was a statement, each color a testament to the city's resilience. However, this underground art was also a symbol of the city's decay and lawlessness. The graffiti-covered trains were seen by many as a reflection of a city in decline, a city struggling to contain the chaos within its depths. In the grime and grit of the subways, New York's youth found a canvas for their frustrations and aspirations. The 1970s also marked a notorious period of high crime in New York City. It was a decade punctuated by a surge in crime rates, with the city's streets steeped in a tension that was almost palpable. Among the many incidents that contributed to this grim reputation was the chilling case of the Son of Sam serial killer. This notorious figure held the city in a grip of fear his reign of terror leaving an indelible mark on the city's psyche. Yet it was not just the high-profile cases that crafted the city's image as a dangerous place. Petty crimes, robberies and muggings were commonplace, making every corner seem fraught with potential danger. However, this era also highlighted the unyielding spirit of New Yorkers. Despite the daily challenges, they soldiered on, demonstrating a remarkable resilience in the face of adversity. The city's streets were tough, but so were its people, demonstrating resilience in the face of adversity. Despite the challenges, the 1970s were also a time of revitalization and innovation. Amid the turmoil, New York City began to bounce back from its fiscal crisis with a remarkable resilience. This period of recovery was marked by audacious urban renewal projects that reshaped the cityscape, breathing new life into the Big Apple. As the decade progressed, the city's financial district started to regain its footing. Wall Street, once teetering on the brink of collapse, began to see a resurgence. This financial revival played a key role in revitalizing New York's economy, setting the stage for the city's future prosperity. In the midst of these transformations, New York also saw the establishment of landmarks that would become icons of the city's skyline. The Twin Towers of the World Trade Center soaring above the city became symbols of New York's indomitable spirit. Madison Square Garden too was reborn in this era, creating a hub for sports, entertainment and culture that continues to captivate audiences to this day. But the 1970s was not just about physical changes. The decade also brought about a cultural renaissance, with New York City becoming a melting pot of creativity and innovation, influencing global trends in art, music and fashion. From the ashes of the 1970s, New York City emerged stronger, setting the stage for the metropolis we know today. This period of revitalization laid the foundation for the dynamic, vibrant and ever-evolving city that millions now call home.